Arctic foxes change color in the summer, but they don't get a fresh new look from Amazon like you and me, so how do they do it? Hi, I'm Nate from PolarGuidebook.com, and in this video, we'll find out how and why the Arctic fox changes color. In winter, Arctic foxes have thick white fur that helps them blend in against the snowy Arctic. This provides camouflage from their predators and helps them to sneak up on their prey without being seen. But as the snow melts in the warmer months of the year, the white fur would make them too obvious. So they shed their long white winter coat for a short summer coat which has more earthy tones such as brown, gray, or red. This helps camouflage them against the vegetation and the rocky terrain in the tundra. This is known as seasonal molting, and Arctic foxes aren't alone. There are 21 different species, including birds and mammals, that change the color of their fur or feathers between the seasons. The exact color change in Arctic foxes can vary by region. Those in wooded areas may have a red or brown summer coat, whereas those in rocky areas may have a grayer coat. The color is determined by melanin pigments in their fur. There are two types of melanin, eumelanin and pheomelanin. Eumelanin results in black or brown colors, whereas pheomelanin creates yellow or red colors. Arctic foxes in different habitats will have a different ratio of the two pigments. This will determine their summer color. But it's not just the color of their fur that changes. As well as providing camouflage, their fur provides insulation. This is why their winter coat is 200% thicker than their summer coat, so that they can stay warm in the cold Arctic. If you look at their winter fur under a microscope, it also contains more air, which makes it more effective at keeping them warm. So when does the seasonal molt happen? They typically lose their white winter coat around May, and then begin growing it back in again in September. It can take several months for the winter coat to fully grow, and it may not reach its full length until early December. But climate change is having an impact on the habitat of the Arctic fox. Notably, the snow is melting earlier each year. This can result in a mismatch between the color of the Arctic fox's winter coat and its surroundings. With less effective camouflage, they become more vulnerable to predators, and they may find it harder to sneak up on their prey. This has also allowed red foxes to creep further north, and they are now flourishing in areas previously dominated by arctic foxes. It's one of the reasons they have become endangered or extinct in parts of Europe. Scientists expect that arctic foxes will adapt the color of their winter coat over time, or even lose it altogether. But evolution takes time, and climate change is happening rapidly. If you want to learn more about arctic foxes, such as the rare blue arctic fox, or how they accidentally got stuck in Iceland, check out this video with 11 fun facts about the arctic fox. That's all for today. Thanks for watching.